Chevrolet three-quarter ton. Oh yeah, the Suburban that I brought back, that one, that green one right there. Had these wheels, mint, mint, like brand new, but the tires, even though they had tons of tread, were cracked. I didn't want to drive it across the country towing a small trailer with a Corvair on the back. So I sold them for 500 bucks. They were like brand new. Not a speck of corrosion, nothing. Not even a little curb rash. So this is a 2000. Yep. Wow, it's an extra cab with a door. I'd yep. love to have that. I got a 93 diesel four wheel drive. But no little door. And you got an intercooler. Yep. So do I. You didn't see that. No. Really? This is a gas job with an intercooler and a turbo. Yeah, I've got an intercooler too, and mine's got a huge dent in it where Mrs. CW hit a curb. Yep. A uh, little bit of rust. I like the headlights. Mine are all yellowed. Do you mind if I look under the hood? And... Yeah, let me fill this up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, gas guzzler. Here we oh, go. Oh, yeah, 12 miles a gallon if I'm lucky. So this is a 350 or a 4.8 or 5.3. No, it's a six, or... 6 liter. I can't. Keep yep. track of all these new motors. I know the three. Intercooler. You got a plastic inner fender. Mine with a nice cut. You cut it very nicely. Well, I tried. You did. That was a bit. The guy that, the guy that did mine just hacked it. Oh yeah, it's not. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Intercooled gas turbocharged. Yeah. And you got the proper clamps too. Mine's got some hacked up junk clamps. Every one's a different size. Uh huh. We're making a video. We spotted a little tailpipe here and we said, What the heck's this little pipe for? Two of them. And they're stainless steel on a pop off valve. And yep. I won't tell anybody that one's fake. No, because it looked kind of cheesy with the one. Oh, wait, the turbo is all the way back here. Yeah. Intercooler all the way down the side. No way. I've never seen this before. Did you get on SDS makes it. You got a monster fuel pump? Had to. I see it. How do you like that? You need to spray this thing with fluid film to rust proof it. Yeah. It's a little on the late side, but at 2000, they're yeah. rotted by now. Yeah, see the turbo comes, the pipes come up through here, goes through the intercooler, and then it comes back. I don't believe it. Yeah, it's a pretty close setup. Luckily, I had breakfast at uh, this convenience store here, otherwise, I wouldn't have spotted this. Yeah. And this is, it's not got uh, nitrous oxide, too. No. No. Nope. That's a solenoid add more fuel? No, nope, that's just a pressurized uh, crankcase. Oh, right, because turbocharged, it'll blow everything up the uh, yep. valve covers. Yep. Yeah, I got a Corvair turbo, by the way, also. Really? I got a bunch of toys. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, and a Corvair ramp side that I might put a supercharger on. This is the blow off valve for when you back out of it. Yep, it shouldn't backfire. Out, it spills out of this. Yep. How do you like that? This is a six liter. Yep. I don't know my Chevy engine. Just a I gas job. Well, they had the 350s, so then they went to the six. frozen. Hard to press the button. All right. Hey, we'll see you. This is cool. Here, I'm Corvair Wild on YouTube. Check me out and get fluid film for this thing so it won't rust. Cool. Got the gauges on the pillar just like mine. Yep. Yeah, I've got an intercooler on mine too. It came like that for the hot, Sweet. hot Arizona desert. Very cool. Take this, take off. Let's hear this thing whistle a little bit. If it can, I'd love to hear it. People on YouTube would love to hear it. This is really cool. Really sweet. Love it. Oh, yeah. Six liters. Turbocharged. Sweet ride, man. Intercooled. Never know what you're gonna find. You should get a race between that one. Let's hear it whistle, man. See, I'm chasing them. Oh yeah, police right there. Hear it? All right, fun's over. There goes Mrs. C.W. She's abandoned me here. Oh, well. <laughs>